In this video, we will review how to insert and format media. To insert a sound or a video, click on the Insert tab and then notice your options in the media group. For this example, we have inserted a video. To adjust the size of it, click on it, click the Video Tools Format tab, use the Nudge buttons to make adjustments to the height and width in the size group, or you can resize it using a corner sizing handle. Make sure you use a corner sizing handle so that it will resize it proportionally. To set start and stop times or trim timing on media clips, select the video, click the Video Tools Playback tab, and then click on Trim Video. In this particular video, if we press play, you can see the title clip is displayed a little too long. So we can drag the start time slider to trim that off. Notice though this video has sound so you wouldn't want to drag it into the sound and trim the sound out because it probably wouldn't sound right. At the end we can trim some of this off because the pointer is just sitting there and there is no sound so we can trim a couple of seconds off of that. It did uh, you know, record our start and end times so now we can just click OK to apply those. To set media options click on the video, return to Video Tools Playback tab and notice the options in the Video Options group. You can adjust the volume, you can adjust when it starts, if you want the video to loop, you have that option, so just make sure you review all of those. You can also link to external media. On this particular computer, I'm not signed in, so when I go to the Insert tab, Media Group, and then the drop down on Video, I can click on Online Video and I should receive an option to search for a Bing video. If you want additional options such as YouTube, make sure you sign in here to do that. For Bing, we'll just put in a little search. And then click on one of the results and click Insert and this will link you to an online video. And you can see that it inserts it. When you run it in slideshow view then you could play it. If you no longer want to use it you can press delete to delete it. And this concludes the review for inserting and formatting media.